The pituitary gland is a ductless gland of the endocrine system that secretes hormones into the blood. It's also known as the hypophysis. The pituitary is divided into the anterior and posterior lobes, also known as the adenohypophysis and neurohypophysis. The functions of the two are similar, to secrete hormones into the blood. However, the mechanism and the hormones released are different. For the anterior pituitary, releasing hormones are secreted by the median eminence neurons of the hypothalamus. These neurons secrete the releasing hormone into the hypophyseal portal veins, which then bring the releasing hormones down into the anterior pituitary, where they stimulate the release of the corresponding hormones from the hormone-secreting epithelial cells. These peptides include thyrotropin-releasing hormone, corticotropin-releasing hormone, gonadotropin-releasing hormone, growth hormone-releasing hormone, as well as dopamine and somatostatin, which are inhibitors of prolactin and growth hormone respectively. The anterior pituitary contains hormone-secreting epithelial cells. These epithelial cells are divided into thyrotrophs, gonadotrophs, corticotrophs, somatotrophs, and lactotrophs. The hormones of the anterior pituitary can be remembered by the mnemonic flat peg. F stands for follicle stimulating hormone, which stimulates oocyte development and estrogen secretion in females, while stimulating development of spermatocytes in males. L is for luteinizing hormone, which stimulates production of progesterone and estrogens in females, while stimulating testosterone production in males. A then stands for ACTH, adrenocorticotropic hormone, responsible for stimulating production of cortisol and the androgenic hormones of the adrenal cortex. T is for thyroid stimulating hormone, which of course stimulates production of thyroid hormone. P is for prolactin, which is involved in the development of the mammary glands and milk production. E stands for endorphins, and G stands for growth hormone, which is responsible for causing growth in children and maintaining bones, as well as other tissues in adults. The posterior pituitary instead receives secretion of hormones directly into its blood supply from neurosecretory cells originating in the hypothalamus. Specifically, nerve cell bodies forming the supraoptic nucleus and paraventricular nucleus. The nerve cell bodies in the supraoptic nucleus produce primarily ADH, antidiuretic hormone, also known as vasopressin. This is responsible for absorption of free water at the level of the kidney and also increases blood pressure via vasoconstriction. The nerve cell bodies in the paraventricular nucleus produce primarily oxytocin, a hormone responsible for uterine contraction and lactation. Oxytocin is also a rare example of positive feedback in the body, and in this case is linked to childbirth and uterine contractions. Other species have an intermediate lobe, but in humans this is limited to a small portion of the anterior lobe. It produces melanocyte-stimulating hormone.